Today we're going to be talking about the four working generations, or the four generations that we're still seeing in the workplace. We have our World War II generation. They were born 1925 to 1945 and are ages 71 plus. Here we have Maya Angelou pictured because she was a very influential person during this generation, as well as being very influential to the baby boom generation. So influential, in fact, that we're still seeing her literature read across the country today. Next, we have our baby boomer generation, born 1946 to 1964, ages 52 to 70. We have Steve Jobs up here. He is a very classic gen baby boomer. The baby boomers were driven, they were competitive, and they brought a lot of changes to the workplace. They brought us business casual, which I know I will forever be grateful for. They also brought us competition in the workplace, like Steve Jobs brought us the competition between Mac and PC that we're still seeing today. Next, we have our Generation X. They were born 1965 to 1981 and are ages 35 to 51. We have Jimmy Fallon pictured because he is a very classic Generation Xer. He had to wait for Jay Leno, or a baby boomer, to retire in order to be able to move up in his career. That is because th there was 80 million baby boomers in the workforce and only 40 million Generation Xers. So this is a challenge that a lot of Generation Xers faced in the workforce. They had to fight for every step that they took. Next, we have our millennial generation, born 1982 to 2000, and are ages 16 to 34. You may have also heard the term Generation Y when it comes to millennials. It's a very common nickname. However, when we're talking about official sociological research, we do use the term millennials. Here we have the royal family pictured because this couple is bringing about changes to the royal family and the way that we view the royal family, just like the way millennials are bringing about changes to the workplace.